Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Play Franbo. I absolutely love this game. It's creepy, it's based off of Alice in Wonderland, it's got Tim Burton-esque art style to it. Her eyes are following her mouth, so that's creepy, and I just freaking love it. It is a psychological horror game. So there's going to be some creepy stuff there, so if you're a little sensitive to this type of stuff, uh, proceed with caution. It's not too bad. I'm usually a whip myself when it comes to horror stuff. This doesn't bother me too much. I'll freak out like, oh, what the fuck? But that's just the extent of it. So without further ado, let's get started with a new game. Yeah, I've already played this. I, I know. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. I see my parents. They look happy. They have a present for me. I wonder. It's a cat! So sweet and pretty. Dark as a deepest night. It's Mr. Midnight! My best friend! My only friend! That's kind of sad. <laughs> He's so cute! We are having dinner and I see Aunt Grace too! I really like her a lot. It's Friday. My parents are going out. Aunt Grace takes good care of me. <laughs> Mr. Midnight with the cream. We are having so much fun. Aww. It's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. But something feels real bad. Ah, shit. A strange creature outside my window. I don't like it. It scares me. Suddenly I hear something. It's mom! Screaming! I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from my parents' room. I go closer. And closer. Uh oh. Mom? Dad? Ah! She's crying blood. Please don't. Ah! Mommy? Daddy? That's not good. That's not good at all. Nope, nope, nope. The house is bleeding! Ow. She failed. Aww. Kitty's comforting us. What is it? <laughs> Squint. Go away! No, Mr. Midnight, where are you going? Don't leave us! Who the fuck is you? Ugh, hooded person. That's always f Great. Fran, please follow my voice. On the count of three, you will wake up. One. Two. Three. Fran, how do you feel? Alright. I feel f I'm fine, I guess. I feel like dying. <laughs> um. Let's go with I'm fine. I'm fine, I guess. Just sad to see the same things. Sadness is something everyone has within. I want to go home. You can't go home, Fran. You have to get well. Not crazy. But I'm not crazy at all. Let me out! You know we cannot do that. But now I have something for you, Fran. What is it? See the desk? There's a package for you. 
It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. Auntie Grace? Alright, now we have control over Fran. Let's over here. Uh, there. there was something over here we could... Fran, stop it. Take your aunt's present now. No, let me out of here. I don't want to go. Fine. This was my mother's purse. Open it. There is something inside. It's a note. Let's examine it. Dearest Fran, here is a purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remembered that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. So I hope you'll keep this pur this purse and give it and all the other things you find a good use. Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift you have. Love, Aunt Grace. She is worried about you. Aunt Grace. Aunt Grace? Well, another reason to let me go. Well, don't worry about her. She is fine. So tired. Let's get. We're tired about this. I'm so tired of this. I just want to go to my room. Yes, you can leave, but before you do, it is time for your new medication. Oh, I don't want to try more medication. It's called duotine, and it will make you feel very relaxed. Nurse, we're ready. Anything new, Doctor Stern? Nothing, actually. Same vision as before. Oh, I see. Here, Fran, take your medicine. I don't want to take the medicine. Fine. I don't feel good. Trippin' balls! Fucking hell. And we're out. Oh no, take her to her room. A nurse? Don't let her take this ever again. That happened. Oh shit. Beware, Frat Row. If you leave the house of madness, I will hunt you down. Catch you. And bring you back to insanity. Mr. Midnight! Fran, wake up. The medicine will help you es escape. I will be waiting for you in the forest. I love you. Oh, kitty! We'll find you, kitty! Chapter 1. My Sober Day. Alright. <clears throat> Pardon me. Oh, this is an inviting room. Let's wake up. Wakey? Wakey? I'm still here. Hideous place. I have to get out of here. Time to explore! The music box. Oh, sweet, sweet melody. One more... <laughs> One more time. La la la. <laughs> it was the same as before. Huh. Okay, I think it's gonna repeat. That's creepy. I will get your nose. I'll get it. Are you happy, clown? Are you happy, clown? Can you make me laugh? I'm having a hard time laughing again. Okay, and she repeats that too. What's this? Is this our patient paper? Yep. Okay, so whole crap load numbers. Name. Fran Bo... Dagenhart? Dagenhart? Age 10. Gender, female, obviously. History. Patient was found near the Oswald Asylum showing signs of psychosis. The Bo... Dagenhart family tragedy. Details omitted. Treatment. Dr. Marcel Dern has tried different medications and all have been cancelled because of side effects. Alright, so this is taking place in the 40s. Hopefully this won't fall on my head while I'm sleeping. I don't want to. I just woke up! Red and Tiny, you are hiding from me. I hate the monster. 
I have to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty. He hides because he is afraid. He told me that the medicine would show me where he is. This kid has more eligible cursive than I do. Can we look out the window? Oops. Oh, holy moly, something fell! A handy hook? I'll save it with the play pirate later. Arr. <laughs> oh, hi. You look like a friendly nurse. My legs are just fine. Um, I'm not disabled. My legs are- okay, she's just gonna repeat that. Empty bottle, empty glasses, nothing useful. Towels? Towels? I don't need towels. I don't think I need any of this. Okay. Oh, that's depressing. You can't even see out that window? Hmm. Not so easy to see through this. Is that the playground? Maybe somebody already tried jumping through the window. Alright, I'm not gonna do her voice while I'm reading through the... Her little messages just when she's talking to people. <laughs> I'm lazy. Oh, friend, you're awake. Good. How long was I asleep? Three days, maybe. Three days. Was it the medication that made me sleepy? Yes, it was a medication. That's why you're not taking it anymore. Uh, something. I'm sorry, something's blocked my screen. Hold on. Screen. I can see! Alright. Nope. Something happened. Oh, I forgot! Something happened! See? You are nothing but trouble. What is it? I was trying to look outside, and I accidentally broke the curtains. <laughs> accidentally. I'll have to fix this. Follow me. Can't do a old lady voice all that well right now. I'm curious, yes, but a nurse is still inside this room. See? Yeah, it was an accident, I swear. Something is missing. Have you seen the hook that holds the curtains up? <laughs> What's the hook? <laughs> I don't think she's gonna believe that, Fran. See nothing. No, miss. I haven't seen anything. Well, I have to go and find something to fix this, you little girl. I have a feeling she wanted to say something else. Bye, bitch. Whoa. Oh, was that her slamming the door leaving? Whatever. Let's look through her desk. Band-aids. Oh. I'll keep these t patches to stop blood. Ah, uh, I can barely read this. All right, Gladys something, Fran Bo Dugenhart, Dagenhart. Probably pronouncing your name wrong. The patient has been sleeping almost all day. What time? She only wakes up to drink water, but I don't think she remembers that. After drinking, she goes to sleep again. She hasn't been social for three days now. Seems some kids have come around and asked about her and when she would come out and play. Oh, all, almost all the time. Okay, I did it. Do a teen. Oh, this is the code to get to it? H. Okay. So every number coincides with the letter of the alphabet. I'll have to remember that if we hit the lock. Ew! Ew! Oh, she just says ew. Violent trauma can have a great impact on children, totally changing their normal lives. For example, children damaged by trauma can have mild to severe Defects and or defects, whatever, and some abilities such as trusting people near them, seeing the world as a safe place, making decisions, etc. Because of these effects, some traumas can lead to several symptoms of major mental illness. For example, not trusting other people or not feeling safe in the world. This can be interpreted as paranoia. Let me see. Traumas. Hmm. Trauma is a word that the doctor loves to say. <laughs> the brain looks like a turtle. <laughs> Let me see. Trauma. Okay, that's what she says. Alright. Hello. 
think this is where the medicine is, but it's locked. Oh, okay, that's why we needed that. So, hi. It said hi. So, eight, nine, five, or four, five. Eight, nine, four, five. What's in here? And she's got a gun. Oh my goodness, it's terrible. Why would the nurse have this? She wants to kill us all. I'll leave it as it was. I really need to get out of this place. Alright, let's try and... Tiny patch of secure rooms. Alright, uh... Examine. My pills are inside. No, I have to... Okay, uh, try... Yeah, here we go. Use. So it was eight... Nine... Oh, crap. Went too far. Uh, God damn it! Four, five. Yay! The pills. Kitty told me these would help me. All right. Um, let's explore my. I didn't look over in this room. Hi! Hey, look, a box. Oh, it's secret box. Shh. Another person. Hello, Phil. Hello. How are you? <laughs> How are you in this mental asylum? Everybody says that I'm sick. <laughs> They're just stupid. I have to find my kid now. Bye. <laughs> They're just stupid. They always say that. They're just stupid. Are you leaving tonight? I will if you help me. The only thing I know is that the office is the key. There's a key inside? The key? Is there a key inside the office? I saw the doctor write a secret code. A secret code? To open the yellow door? He doesn't want me to tell you. The doctor? Who? Him. Him. What the f- All doors are closed. You are a prisoner of my games. And nobody will help you escape. Oh my god. Leave me alone! I hate you! What the fuck is that thing? Poor Fran. Mommy, Daddy, I need you so much right now. No, I won't let that monster stop me. I used to have a blue dress like yours. I can't play with you now. I'm on a very secret mission. Okay. Ooh, when Mr. Horse, are you having a good time? Back and forth. The trip of our lives. Yeehaw! <laughs> okay. If I sit down, I will eventually get up. So what's the point? To be seated or not to be seated? That is the question. Okay. Uh, of course it's locked. Still locked. If I were bigger, I could take it down. Probably not. Okay. So, what's up with you? Fillmore Bronstone. Age 8. He's two years younger than us. Male history. The patient came to Oswald's asylum with his mother, Rachel Bronstone. The boy has has developed paranoid behavior. Paranoia not yet di diagnosed. Ugh. Treatment. Daily treatment with Dr. Marcel Dern. We have not achieved the patient's trust and he refuses to be questioned. So he's been in here longer than us because we got our paper was documented July 25th. This is April 6th, so he's been here a little longer than us. Teddy bear! Can we take the teddy bear? I hope somebody loves you. Hello again, Mr. Teddy. Alright. Can we talk to this kid again? Did you find the doctor's code yet? It was It's in the office. Alright. Um... Can we check to see if there's anything in this drawer? Locked. Good reason to get curious. I should get the key for this. Still closed. I like how, like, if I click on it, she just glares at me like, Yeah, it's closed, idiot. <laughs> Alright, let's take these things. Ah! It was not me. Who the fuck are you? Oh, that's lovely. Oh, is that my head? Give me my head back, please. Just go away, you weird creatures. 
Ah! Another dead bunny! Oh, are you sleeping, sweet bunny? No, Br Fran, I don't think you're sleeping. Bunny, wake up! Please, bunny, just wake up. It not sleeping. It not sleeping. Where'd the clown go? <laughs> Where did the clown go? I hope he's not around here. Ah. It looks like he escaped from the painting. Oh, God. Who did it? I wish I could know the answer. I'll find out, I promise. Alright, it wasn't me. I kind of don't want to go down there yet. I want to explore around here. Ah! What the fuck? Get out, creepy creature. What are you, huh? Tell me. You like to see me sad? Alright. Hello, Miss Nurse. Are you alright? Hello? Hm. Alright. I can answer. Ooh, we got something. Excuse me, lady nurse. This may be useful. Watch your step. What are we gonna see out here? Oh, pardon me. Still boarded up. You gonna see the same thing? Oh no! Oh, there's a handprint. On the playground. Good night, trees and moon. I'm pretty sure the playground isn't a good escape route. Hmm. I like the bunny swing thingy. It makes me dizzy. Oh, those things. I hated those things. I always fell right off. Alright. Uh, let's see what... Oh, god. Is his mouth, like, stitched shut? What are those black things? I can't remember. Why are you looking at me like that? You terrify me. What is that black thing sitting next to you? He's telling you things. Can you hear it? Okay, and she is repeating. It's like you click three times and she'll repeat the same thing. You can see. Can you see? To happiness. Hi, who are you? Ah! Hello? Oh no, your head! I'll try to put your head back on. Ah, we made it worse. I'm sorry I couldn't help you, Mr. Dear. Okay. You're creepy. Let's go down here. Hey, it's our aunt. Absolutely, no, absolutely not. You can't tell her that. But she has a right to know. She can't, you can't keep her away from me. The reason is more than clear, Grace. No, it's not. I want to take her home now. You can't. Fran's mental condition is not appropriate yet. Oh, and she passed out. There's a f crying fox. Was that real? Oh, dear Aunt Grace. I wonder what she has to tell me. That doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight. Hi, Mr. Fox. So we can't go back there. Oh, no. Foxy Fox, don't cry. Use my hand as a tissue. Would you like a hug? Foxy? Why are you so sad? Goody day it. Alright. So... Uh, I think I checked everything. Oh, wait. Locked. Okay. Is there a way we can pickpocket that? Can we use the, um... So we need a needle? Even if it works, I don't know what purpose. Oh! We could open that. A key. This will certainly open something. Like a table drawer? Yes! I got it and there's something inside. A photograph and bobby pin. Ooh. Let's look at the photograph. Ah, oh, It's not a very good uh, picture. I like how the cats remained unharmed. I miss you so much. I really need you here with me. I will find my kitty and get to you, Aunt Grace. I know Aunt Grace will take good care of me and Mr. Midnight. Okay. I wonder if we s don't stop taking those. Yay, everything's back to normal. Uh, if the picture will change. Yeah, it looks normal now. Oh, my dear family. Okay, she just says the same thing. Alright, um. So, can we use the. Buy pin to open the door? Uh, well, we'll see. Alright, 
let's see if we can maybe combine. Yay! My very own special key. Alright, oh. Forgot to hit the use. Let's see if we can use it to get at it. Yes! Yes to happiness! To happiness. What would happen if we took this? Who are you? What was that? Daddy was- wait, what does that say? Daddy was not there. Mommy would not care. Oh boy. Bore it up again. The maze! We never get to play in there. Whoa! Tonight the fog is pretty thick! Thick enough to cover our tracks? I wish I could get lost in there. Alright. Whoa! Where'd you come from? You are my beloved friend, beep beep. If you want to hug me, try and catch me. If you can't catch me, it's because you haven't found me. Beep beep. Is this supposed to be like a mechanical version of Mr. Midnight? Fran likes it. Fran likes it. The king likes drawings. I don't like it. Ah! Some roads are so interesting. Uh, and we can't get through here. What? This wasn't here before. Okay, she just said the same thing over and over again. Um. And we don't see anything. Oh, oh, it's not boarded up anymore. That's interesting. Was there anything else in here? The throne is empty. I didn't realize anybody could see me pooping. Gross! I can and will hold it. <laughs> that is pretty gross. Alright, can we go up? Nah, it's too good. I figured it's too good to be true. Ha! <laughs> there you are! You should be in your room. The door was closed. You left it open. I opened it with my key. Um. Should we try I lie to her or should we be a little ashamed? Like, yeah. Open it with my key. Was that door already open before I tried to go down? Shit. Eh, let's be a little shit. I opened it with my fantastic key. What key? Give it to me. I don't have it anymore. Don't try to trick me. Go inside your room and wait for the doctor. Damn. Ugh, I have no time for this. I have to find my way out. Hi, dude. How's it going, Doc? Did you break out of your room? That's not nice, friend. My kitty told me to leave. Uh, let's go further out. That doesn't make it look crazy. I haven't eaten in days. But I'm hungry, sir. I haven't eaten in days. I won't listen to any of your excuses, young lady. I'm not making up excuses. Let me go with something to eat. It's true, we haven't- we've been asleep for three days. And granted, the nurse's note said that we woke up to drink water, but she only said we got water, not food. Um... I'm not making up excuse- anytime a child goes, I'm not making up excuse, adults always go, yes you are, so let's just go, let me get something in. So doctor, please just let me go out and eat something. You have to learn how to listen to those in charge. You, <laughs> you big people. Lesson learned. Should we keep fighting or just do what we're told? Because we're going to end up getting out of here anyways. <laughs> Get him to trust us. Lesson learned. Of course, sir. Lesson learned. Just don't do it again, Fran. Go and eat now. Then go back. Get back to bed. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right. What's in here? Hi! You like the draw? Ooh, let me see. A red puppet and a serpent. A teddy bear and many other things. Alright, that's gonna... Right. <laughs> snuggle, snuggle, old lady on your chair. And your booty would be flat like your face. Fuck. <laughs> Let's see. Ooh, real flowers! They smell so sweet. The drawer is empty. Okay. This bed is very pink. Very, 
Her room was a hell of a lot nicer than ours. She actually has like a nice looking bed, she's got toys. We have a music box. Oh, this is one of those mute clowns. I've seen so many and they all look sad. This one is very happy though. Good for him. Alright, let's talk to her. Hello! You see them. You do, right? What? See what? The creatures that follow everyone. You mean the shadows? Uh-huh. I can't see them, but I know they are there. You know what they are? Do you know what they are? Yeah, I guess. Tell me, please. You like to draw? I love to draw. I love it. Yes, I love it too. But please tell me about the shadows. Crayon. I need a crayon. I want to find a crayon. I draw all the time. I want to find my cat. Uh, let's keep it on her right now. What are you drawing? Something. That's very specific. What is it? My dreams. Go now. Oh, whoop. They mean to do that. Okay, so we gotta find her a crayon. Can we take one of those? That's mine! My crayons! Can I have it? I just like this green crayon so much. Can I have it? No, I won't be able to draw green then. That's ridiculous. But you have so many. Oh, that's true, but you have so many other colors. Yes, many colors. But you know, they don't like me drawing. Who? The nurses. They tie me up, and when I want to draw, I can't. Me too, sometimes. Yeah, they tie me up sometimes too. It hurts. When I can't draw, I hurt myself. Then comes red milk. Look. Red milk. Oh. Poor child. Please, cure me, yes? And stop the red milk. I'll see what I can do. So she calls blood red milk. Okay. I'll see what I can do. And I think this is where our handy dandy bandage is coming to play. Ad... Ad... Lydia? Ad Lydia? I don't know. Ah, Help me out a fellow inmate. Oh, thank you! You can have the crayon! Now go! I have to draw! Yay! We got a crayon! Let's see what's wrong with her! Add Lydia... Fung Fugent? Age 7. So far, we're the oldest kid in this asylum. History. The patient was a victim of sexual abuse by an unknown person which almost killed her. Oh my god! This event has created auditory hallucinations and thought disorder treatment. Dr. Marcel Dern has become close to the patient through drawing therapy. She is making process. So if the drawing is part of her therapy, then why the hell are the nurses preventing her from drawing? They just sound like they just don't want to deal with these kids. That poor girl. Or maybe it's because she's drawing on the walls, but I'm gonna go with my grave theory. Uh, what does her room look like when we're on the pills? Oh my god! Well, oh. <laughs> that clown didn't get very far. Where did the clown go? I hope he's not around here. It looks like he skipped from the painting. Oh, I think that's what she said with our painting. The clown's right there! I don't want to touch it! It's a clown from the painting! Maybe if I touch it, it will jump and scare me a lot. Alright, nothing happened. It must be dead. I like how she's so, like, nonchalant about all of this. She is so far gone that not none of this is really phasing her. Oh, the flowers are dead. Even the purest of things die in this place. Alright. Tiny, tiny hands all over you, eating your soul. God, she looks evil right there. Alright, um, she looks like a yarn doll now. Why do you look like a fabric doll? What have they done to you? Please, somebody tell me something! Alright, go out here. There's the cat toy again, alright. Now let's go down here, because we apparently can't if we are on the pills. Freedom? It's the freedom! The yellow door, that's my way out! 
I have to open it, but how? Phil said that the doctor's office is the key. I wonder what that blinking light is for. It's very hypnotic. Hello? I wish I could shut it down. It's probably the security system. This gate is very locked. I guess I haven't seen this gate unlocked. Not even when I first came here, because I don't remember that. Okay. Can somebody answer that damn phone? The reception room. You can always find a nurse there. I could smile and bow and tell the nurse to open the gate. But then again, they really think I'm insane. Which we are not. Hi. Is that the key? I think it's the key. Jump! That's the office key. It must be. But how, what can I do to reach it? Hey, what are you looking at? Nothing, I think. The key! Can I have it? Let's be like a little kid. <laughs> the key is what you give it to me? Sure, I can give it to you the key if you give me a kiss. Fuck you! Fuck off with your pedophile bullshit! <laughs> you should kiss your butt! What a bastard! You can kiss your butt! Such a language. I told you kiss for the key, what do you say, huh? Fucking hell. What have you done to these kids in this place? Annie Schultz. Damien Goldsman. Charles Hick Frambo. Okay, so those are the people he needs to see today. It's a special place in hell for people like you. Hi! Hello! Are you alright? What is that supposed to mean? I just want to know if you feel okay. I don't want to tell. The doctor will cut your head open if you don't leave. He likes to eat brains. He already took mine. He ate all my thoughts. He ate your brain? He will eat yours too. I saw you inside the doctor's office. You were dead. Oh no, then I have to go. I hope you find new thoughts. Bye! Alright, what's in here? Oh, what happened to your head? You're passed out. Isabel! She won't wake up. I guess that means she is heavily sedated. Oh, the poor child. Would you like to help me escape? With your big muscles and hairy arms? You could break through every wall. Too bad you are a stuffed animal. Good night, shiny toys. Have you seen my kitty? He is the most funny and clever guy. You would like him. Alright. Elephant sir, you are very pink and soft. You look like you have been training at the circus. And your tummy is filled with love. Aw. Do they put like a clown photo painting for every child in the room? Actually, Phil didn't have one, did he? I don't think so. Oh, I missed what she said the first time. You were way better inside the frame than down here, sir. Clowns on a wall in the house of madness. Okay. Your tiny hat is very sweet. The smile on your face is quite scary. Yeah, it is. Did you say something? Ugh, creepy. Alright, let's talk to this kid. Hello, what are you doing? It doesn't work. The paper is not working. What do you mean? The paper should be working like they told me. Who told you that? They told me to tell myself to do this. Paper vision. Paper vision? <laughs> Can I help you with something? The waves must be powerful. Change the channel, please. Change it yourself. You're sitting right there. We are losing the waves. Channel change. Fine. The super ha hyper happy cupcake dance. That would drive me insane. No program or anything other than these hypnotic colors. Yeah. Human testing approved. Oh god. News. Human testing approved. That's no news, Mr. Announcer. Yep. Nothing. Nothing. Look! Nature! Oh, a documentary maybe. I guess it's about ants and pine cones. That's how I said. Pine cones and ants. No signal. 
I think this was the one. It was one of the ones that didn't have anything on there. Let's try this. First round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It works! It works! A miracle! Thank you! Paper vision positive! Great, can I see? No, this is mine. If you want it, you have to take the paper that didn't work. Wouldn't that kill me? Uh, let's just get out of here. Thank you, bye! Now we have paper to go with our crayons! There was a thing that said that the king likes drawings, so maybe this is how we can draw. I don't know who they mean about the king. I don't know what to draw right now. Oh, okay. Damn it. Never mind. The action man! Can I- The action men! Can either of you help me find my kitty? The soldier lost his leg in the war! And the cowboy ate the princess! That was random. Okay. Ooh! What's this? Oh! The pink sash is mine now! All mine! Yeah. Uh, can we find anything on the pills? Oh my god. Uh, oh my god! His head went kaplooey. Oh no, they did it all wrong! They cut your head into little pe pieces! Please take me out of here! Please take me out of here! There's no police like home! There's no police like home! Whoa. Has anyone seen that? It's her face, but crying blood. Oh my god. Look at me. I say I care. Well, ah, oh, god damn it. God damn. It. Oh, I want to read it like from the beginning. Look, Look at, at me. me. I, I say, say I care, care while you are dying, dying of hunger and thirst. thirst. Look, Look at, at me, I say you're beautiful while I give you poison to eat. Look at me, I say I love you while I'm teaching you to hate yourself. What the fuck are you? Hanging on, huh? Well, uh, I don't think it would fit me anyways. Hey! Get off her! Wake up, Isabel! The black shadow is touching you! It says that you're going to die soon. Are you afraid of death? I hope not, because it may happen even if you don't like it. Oh shit, so she's gonna die soon? Have you seen my kitty? He's- oh, never mind. I already talked to him before. Hide your pain. <gasps> Where'd the girl go? Teddy! Teddy, what are you doing here? Are you on your way to meet another Teddy? Say hello for me when you get there. I will laugh at you. I will lie to you. I will hide you inside the shadows. I will laugh at you. I will lie. Okay, Just saying the old same thing over and over again. Jesus Christ! Hi. Um. Hi, Jason. Um. Hi. You were the one that gave me the duo team. Hello. Oh, hello, Fran. How are you today? <laughs> I see- oh, god damn it. <laughs> I see dead animals. Let's go with that. I see dead animals, miss. You mean in the television? No, for real. <laughs> no, I mean for real. Just forget it. Very well, Fran. Go play with your friends now. <laughs> it's like, that's nice, dear. Ooh, food. I wonder if that pasta was cooked today. Not by the looks of it. The salad looks fresh for once. Milky milk. I guess that carton, this carton is all sour, like always. Hey, look, Teddy. The sofa made to be sat on. I can't sit. The soda is taken. The sofa is taken. Soda. <laughs> this smells like poo. What have I here? Chocolate? Yummy. I don't like bitter coffee. The menu of the day: pasta. All right. The signal is weird. That must be because we're so far away from everything. I don't really understand what they're saying. Mommy loves to paint roses. Okay. Who is this? I don't like this painting. It feels like Mr. Oswald is staring at me. I guess Mr. Oswald is very old, old enough to be dead. I don't like this painting. Okay. Mr. Midnight, are you there? I suppose not. Oh dear, what should I do if I find my kitty? Hello! Are you near here? I haven't seen you before! 
No. Are you from downstairs? Uh-huh. They think I'm better now. <laughs> Good for you, bye! <laughs> Fran! What's your name? Could you please kill me? Please. Wait, what? Uh... I'm hoping not really. Sure! Bang! You are dead! Thank you. I can't talk now. I'm dead. Okay, that was interesting. Lemonade. A little lemonade. I'm not that thirsty. I miss it in the midnight. That's the only thing I know. Ooh. Mm, I can see the cinnamon bone melting in my mouth. Alright. What is over here? Hi! Hi! Okay, bye. Milk. Annie loves to drink milk. Drink the milk like a kitten. Sadly, she's not my cat. I'm going to miss her. I guess she won't remember me. Okay then. Stop! In the name of love. Sorry. This door is always locked at night. Hold on. This door is always locked at night. I can't get out and play. I guess I'll have to wait until tomorrow, but that's absurd. I have to find my kitty. Hey, look! Crutch! Let's take it. Don't touch my sword! I didn't know it was yours. You should bow and speak clearly to me. I am your king. Oh, is this the king that Varian was talking about? You are not the king. Let's play along. Oh, I bow to you, sir. Very well, my child. What is the purpose of your visit? I want your walking cane. What walking cane? Do you mean my sword? Yes, your highness, your sword. What would you give me in exchange? Anything you need, your highness. Bring me a castle and a horse. Only then shall I grant you my sword. And this is where we draw. Ta -da! I'll draw something special for the king. Take it and use it on him. Ah, he looks so happy. Ah, oh, that's beautiful. Exactly what I dreamt of. You can take my sword now. It's yours. Never mind the fact that, you know, might need it to uh, walk, but whatever. And I think we can combine this and this. And then this with this. Yay! Now I can reach high. I'll call this the Grabomatic 2000. What's the place look like when it's like this? What? Where'd they go? Where'd they go? You saw that too, right? Oh my god, it's pulsating. It's alive! If Kid were here, he would probably attack it. Hope it doesn't start following me. Oh god. Please tell me if you can hear me. Why do you have this creature next to you? He's staring at you. Maybe he wants to eat you. That holy man took all your clothes off. Oh no. Oh, how could it all those bruises on her, right? Your mama doesn't believe you? Oh my god, this kid was molested by a priest. Oh my god. Oh, the nurse is dead. Hey, get off him. They, they hide, hide you because, because they, they love you. They, they harm you because they hate you. Oh, little boy, everyone feels ashamed of you. Jesus Christ, are, these things are like negative emotions. Oh no, the nurse lady died! The lady nurse died! I wonder who did this, it wasn't me! She smells real bad. It feels like the smell is all over me. The chocolate is perfectly fine though! <laughs> oh, Google clock. The grandfather clock is big and grand. It's not very big. Tick tock, tick tock. It will never stop. Okay, so we know what's in here. What about where that pedophile is? Oh! Shit. Reach the key. Yeah, I kind of figured that much. It's pulsating! wonder what part of the body this is. Sticky bloody parts. I don't want to touch it. Uh, Mr. Pig is naked. Mr. Pig has no wing to fly with. 
No flying Mr. Pig here for me to see. Ew, a crunchy pig's head ready to be served. I wonder who would eat it. I think my kitty would be afraid of it. Alright. Well, that's over here. Oh! Shit! Hello there, miss. Your dress is very pretty. Stained with blood, but very pretty. My mother had very dre pretty dresses, too. Alright, and then she used rupees. Oh, this clock sounds odd. I feel like it's whispering right in my ear. I can't understand what it says. Can we examine this pocket watch? A bleeding clock. It's like time is broken and stopped. I find clocks to be a bit depressing. Hmm. Oh, that clock size looks like Mr. Midnight. Maybe it's because time is running out for him. Oh, my dear kitty, I have to find you. Okay. Alright, so let's cancel that out. We could try for the key, however, um, I don't think we'll be able to get to it because of that guy. Hi! Annie! We can talk to you now. Hi, Annie! How are you? Are you afraid of me? No, why would I? Because I can do magic tricks and make you sleepy. Damn it. Magical tricks? I didn't know you could. Show me. Show you, but it's very scary. It's better if you do it. I can't. I'm not a magician. I can give you the magic stuff. Really? Woo! <laughs> Woo! What the hell was that? Yes. The magical stuff that makes everyone fall asleep. That's amazing! Powerful and grand! Here, as a gift. Take it slowly. It's sleep aid. Or a sedative. How does it work? I have no idea. Alright, thanks. And... I'm pretty sure we can combine it with... This. <laughs> Oh, this is a magical cake now, a sleepy sleepy cake. And we can try and give it to that guard. But I think you get an achievement if you're able to convince him to take the cake. Because there's two ways of going through this, and I can't remember right off the top of my head. I'm going to try for it. But I might not be successful because it's been so long. It's been over a year since I played this game. Where are your shoes, child? I just noticed that. Hey, Petto, have a cinnamon bun. A cake, eat it! Look, a cake, eat it! I'm not interested in taking anything that comes from you. Um, You'll regret it! This is probably not the way to go, but whatever. Oh well, you'll regret it, it's very yummy. Alright, leave it on the table, eat it later. Oh my god, that is how you convince him! You get really pushy! Fresh from the oven, it's very yummy. I'm hoping neither one of these, like, fucks it up. Oh, why not? No, it's very, very yummy. No, now leave me alone. Fuck! I did mess it up! Shit! Fresh from the oven. Damn it! So much for that achievement. So I guess we say fresh from the oven. So if you want to get that... Click the oven mo um, option. Okay. Hey, it's a bitch nurse. I told Marcel about the last delivery, but he hasn't looked it up yet. Well, he'll catch up soon. Oh, it's a lady nurse. Well, he will catch up soon. Hey, Gladys, can you do me a favor? Sure. Anything but bring coffee to the guard. Why not? I can't do it because I have to take care of the children. I have other things to do for myself. Sorry. Nobody likes this pedo guard. Maybe if we can take it. Fran, I told you, go mind your own business. I'm very busy. Hey, yeah, we can take it to him. Oh my goodness, sorry lovely fingers, that's very hot. 
So this is the other way to do it if all else failed. This is actually much more satisfying than just knocking them out with a drugged cinnamon roll. Hey, asshole, have some hot coffee. Here's your hot, hot, co hot coffee, sir. <laughs> yeah! Good girl! Look what you did, you insane orphan bitch! You did that on purpose! Fuck yeah, we did! Now I have to go and change. God, burning like hell! Don't go anywhere, you little shit! Fuck you, pedo! If I call emergency, I don't think they would help me. This table isn't interesting at all. Alright, well, let's go get that key now that that guy's uh, away. I got you! Now I can unlock the office. Let's do this! I'm invading your privacy, Mr. Doctor. Ooh, billboard. Mental health. Global week. Ah, oh, dang, I'm so burpy. DH test now testing. Try on. Blah, blah. Testing day. Every day is testing day. October and November. I guess we're in October now. So she's been here since July. July, August, September, October. So about three, four months. What a tiny text. Thoughts of Dr. Thoughts of Marcel Dern. <laughs> An interview with Dr. Dern about working with children. You are not alone. Join us today. Oswald Asylum. There's her code. Oh, I didn't get to read that. Oh, I've seen this before. What does it mean? Hmm. I see a key. Actually, let's look good for other stuff before we do that. My brain is so complicated. I don't even understand all of my thoughts. I guess nobody does completely. Vision, taste, and hearing. I learned some of this at school. I don't remember it at all. The books are all the same. I wonder whose head this is. Let's type a message. The yellow typewriter! I could write a letter to Aunt Grace. Dear Aunt Grace, get me out of here, please. Oh, I love the open mail, but this is not for me. Read a book. No pictures or funny riddles. Mr. Midnight could tell me a riddle. He loves riddles. This book is not interesting. The doctor ate an apple. I could use this as a helmet to prevent injuries when I faint. But I guess my hair does a good job too. No, sweetheart, it doesn't. I hate this bed. I'm not lying down there. I've cried so many times here. The doctor used to sit here and do nothing. Alright, now let's take this key. It's always good to carry an extra key. Okay, what did this say? Dr. Masil, turn off the alarm from the security panel in the reception room. The yellow door will remain open for two minutes until the alarm reactivates. Alarm code. December 17, July 25. That looks like a 31. So is it the month? The number of the month plus the, um... Day? Cause that looks like a 31. July is the... That's the 7th month, right? So that would actually be 32. I don't know, I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out. This code is very important. Alright, let's get out of here. Hey, Phil! Phil? A forgotten girl with no family or cat will die when the moon arrives. What do you mean? No! You motherfucker! Fill up! Ugh, Phil, please let me out! I shouldn't scream. If they find me in here, I'm in big trouble. Where did I put the key? Um, <laughs> we lost the key when we used it, of course. I don't really know what this is. Cool air comes out of it, like the wind. I guess behind this, there's a hole. A wind hole. So I'm guessing there's nothing in this. Normal. Ah! What the? I don't want to 
talk to that. Even though your eyes are open, you don't understand. Even though your eyes are bleeding, you can't feel. Don't hide what hurts. Let it hurt you. Oh my god. Ooh. That dead girl looks a bit like me. Well, I'm sedated and I see weird stuff, but I'm not dead. I can breathe and talk and all things a living person does. Oh my god. Oh, we got no choice but to go over here. Oh god. Oh, the wind hole. I guess this is my way back. I wonder if Phil knew about this. Crawling, 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 crawling. Ah! Oh, that rat really hit his head. I should give it a helmet. Fran, I think that rat is the least of your concern. Uh-oh. Fran, be careful. Fran, be careful. I'll just keep going and going. And going and going like the energy other bunny. Fran? Watch it. Nope. Ah! Ow. This girl hits her head a lot and falls a lot. Oh dear, where am I now? I guess I'll have to find out. Wakey, wakey. Well, it looks like we're in the basement. A mop that will dance on the floor. Mr. Midnight hates mops. He always tried to kill them with his ferocious paws. I would think that would be more like what a cat would do with a vacuum. Oh, I was talking about all of this. Okay. Huh. Cleaning products. They should clean our toilets. Sponges and washcloths and t thousands of chemicals. I don't think I need any of this. No water to wash my hands. Alright, what's over here? Hey, the box! What's in the box? Let's see. Bad pills. I just take them to find my kitty. Hold on. There's two different colored duotine. Yellow pills. They look more f like more fun than the red ones. I wonder why I got the r red pills instead of the yellow. Maybe they just ran out of the color. I think I'll quit when I find Mr. Midnight. Maybe or maybe I'll just until I take them all. The bottle is empty. I guess they put in some pills in it. Scraped label. Hmm. Patient. I think that's Fran's number. It's our current target. Target response is positive. Now expanding the triggered gland. Exo. Ectoplomatin? Dose up to 700 mcg. Change the container so it looks like an improved variant of duotine. Ectoplomatin? Ectoplomatin? Ecto. like ectoplasm? Like ghost? What? There's nothing under the blanket. Old and rusty. I guess I have a place to sleep if I can't find a way out. Oh, if I were a witch, I could fly out of here. I'd love- I'd fly to my kitty where the night is filled with shining stars. And we would visit curious places because we both like curious things. This is where she's like a lot, Alice. We also hold curious things. And I think this is the- Why don't we use open this? Yeah, freedom! What the- NOT YOU AGAIN! If you struggle, you will know that it was I. I will be in every corner to make you suffer and cry. If you choose to disobey, your cat's life will be marked. No, no- Oh, and she fell down the stairs. Ow. Oh, my dear kitty. We'll soon be together again, I promise. I miss you, my dear. I miss you s so much. Is this Fran or the cat talking? Oh, it's Fran. Why are you leaving? Please don't leave me alone, Mr. Midnight. Maze. At the end of the maze, Fran. The cat talks to us in her sleep. I fainted again. I wonder if my dreams are true. The monster won't let me go home. But if I find the maze, maybe I can find Mr. Midnight. Stupid monster. Hey, at least I left the door unlocked. Mm, pardon me, damn. Operating room, patient Robert Clark, psychosurgery procedure, lobotomy. 
Dr. Roman Bates. Hey, another doctor in this place. Observation failed and aesthetic. Patient woke up after reaching frontal lobe. The procedure was canceled and incomplete. Was that the kid with the mask? Is that why he had the mask? Because they do lobotomies, they do it like through the eye. Fuck. Oh. The operating room. I don't want to go inside. This smells like rotting flesh. Ugh. I don't want someone to place my head in there. You can smell it right through that door? What's going on here? Oh my god. Oh no, poor girls. I hope they get well soon. I hope I never end up like this. I won't if I leave this sick place and find Mr. Midnight. Ugh, you do not look good. Hello, are you resting? Did you puke? That's disgusting. Fran, leave him alone. I hope you get well soon. Alright. Oh, so I did go all the way around. I'm just under the kitchen now. But I can't go upstairs, it's locked. Alright. Oh wait, that was the operating room. I don't know what I'm thinking. What does this place look like on the pills? Ah! What the fuck? You, you can't, can't blame those who are ignorant. ignorant. But, but you can't let ignorance, ignorance decide. Life, Life will teach you even through pain and tears. tears. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Clown Horse Thing. I don't know. Hi! My path to life has been denied. I haven't been born, but I was alive. I'm waiting for a mother to love me. Were you aborted? Oh shit! Who is that, sir? Wake up! Right, that's what she's saying there. Ugh, fucking clowns. Fuck you, clowns. It word. It says it word. I don't know what that means. I don't know either. Oh my god. Oh boy, where? Why do you have your brain out? Is it too warm in there? Didn't won't answer. I guess the mice will come and have some meat. Fran. Child. No. Oh hey, we're back normal. Yes, I took the one new one upstairs. Franbo? No, I haven't seen her. What? The key to the cellar? Well, no. In the doctor's office? He used to have the key there. Calm down, the key is not here. Sure, I'll let you know if it turns up, but you must calm down. Yes, I'll bring it to you if I find it, alright? Bye. Your man, that's okay. But how are we gonna get it over there? Baby shaking syndrome. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this. I'm at the reception already. This is grand. But the nurse, I have to get rid of her. What should I do? Okay, I can't do anything. I can't even move. So let's take the pills. And she's gone. At the end of the maze. And we can suddenly walk around. Oh, I know this. My baby, my teacher told me about it. It's when crazy parents shake their babies. Bastards. And the babies bleed inside. Many die. Poor babies. Oh, you're all skinny. Yuck. Skinny is nothing but bones. Why are you hanging up there? Are you a nurse too? What's under here? Oh, it's... Oh my goodness, are you okay, little baby? Little baby? Is that your mommy hanging up there? Do you miss her? I miss my mommy too. So was this a pregnant person that she hung with? What is all this? What is she seeing? This is exactly what Mr. Midnight told me. I wonder what's at the end of the maze. Whatever it is, I hope I can find my kitty. Alright. It's a phone. I can't remember Aunt Grace's phone number. I'll just surprise her when I get home. Ooh, a love letter. Dear Pete. Ugh, gross. Alright. Hey, the thing is gone too. So I guess we just put the key here. 
There you go. I hope the nurse sees keys, so... What do we do? Ooh. Hey! We're over here. Okay. Oh, the key! Was he the key was here after all. I'd better take it back. No matter, like, oh... Where'd the fuck this come from? Nope. You don't care. Old coffee. No crackers. I want to go home. Many folders and books. They must have a record of every kid. They sure say that everyone is insane. Okay, so now we gotta un deactivate the thing. Yeah. I figured that'd be wrong. Okay, I can't remember how I figured this out. December... 17, July, 55. <sighs> okay, I have to do mental math here. So, I think it was the number of the month plus the number that's on there. So, December is 12th month. That's 12 plus 17. That is 29. Yeah. July is the Seventh month? Seven plus twenty-five, that would be thirty-two. So twenty-nine thirty-two? I don't know, let's try it. Yay! <laughs> yes, I'm the best, the very best! I was able to do mental math. That's usually very hard for me. Bye! -bye. And away we go! Bye, motherfuckers! Hey, that was supposed to be open for two minutes before the alarm went off. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh no. You little bitch! I will make you pay for what you did! Nope, nope, what the- Oh! Fuck! Ah! You clever little girl. You think you can just leave. Hey, let's go, let go, let go, let go, let go. What? No, it can't be. No! Is there a wheelie friend? Wake up, friend! So, that guy died, now he's gone. I need to get to the maze. Lead the way, mechanical kitty. Down the rabbit hole. Okay, so we're gone. You're alive? But we weren't on the pills. I don't know. Mini game time, so we gotta try and figure this out. You can skip this if you want, but I'm not gonna. <laughs> so we gotta find our way through the maze. If I remember correctly, there's gonna be some things we got to avoid. Oh, wrong way. I lost sight of the kitty. We were gonna do that anyways. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. There it is. That's what we have to avoid. Okay. Alrighty. God, these things are creepy. <laughs> Going the right way? Yay, cross the river. Nope, 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 bup, 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 bup. Nope. Uh, I know going straight is not the right way to go. Yeah, this was this was a I hear the cat! Oh. I didn't realize that was open. Wrong way. Of course. We 
can't touch right. Yeah. Okay, so we gotta follow behind it, hide in there until it comes back. Okay. Can you come back already? If I go to there, yeah, I would say if I go to move, it's gonna come right back, and I'm gonna probably get sent right to the very your bit, but yeah, beginning words. Go in here, go, go in here, go in here. Oh, am I further enough, far enough in? Oh, I'm scared. Okay, I am. Okay. Go, child, go. Yeah! I was like, what are you doing? Oh my god. She's just like staring. At the end of the maze, you will find Woo. the evil cre critters of the night. They will hunt you. They will laugh. But there will always be a good side. A cat full of nuts and bolts. will always be your guide. No, our picture! <laughs> Forget it, friend! Go! Go! Just go! Chapter 2, Part 1, Curiosity Symptoms. Alright. And that is where we're going to leave it for today. Oh my goodness, that was close. I hope the guards don't find the sewer. Get out of here. Oh, what is this place? I hope I find Mr. Midnight soon. Okay, yeah, now we're ending it here. Um, I miss playing this game so much. I don't know why I only played it once. <laughs> but, um... Yep! That's Fran Bo. Uh, it's gonna get even more weirder from there on out. <laughs> so, um, until next time, bye! <laughs>